Welcome to the second to last words of the day of the year 2020. No, wait, because we'll have, you, we'll have them next year. Okay, so of the 2019-2020 school year, there we go. Okay, day 94. It's summer out there. It's nice. So if you're watching this, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, if you're watching this, that means you're one of the hardcore students that stuck around to the second to last day of school. And you're still watching videos because even though we're not doing a whole lot of school work, you're still working right now, right? Because look, we're going to talk about some awesome words. Because today's words of the day for day 94, second to last day of school, during the craziest school year pretty much ever that I can remember, which is, well, like, well, let's not even go there. And yeah, so here we go, concise. Now my introduction to this words of the day was not concise because concise means express, expressing much in few words. My introduction earlier was not few words, no. Okay, so to use, wait, I already used concise in a sentence. Look at that, nice. My introduction was not concise. Concise modifies introduction, not concise. Okay, dissipate. Uh, to cause to separate and go in different directions. This is a really good word. Dissipate is uh, like if you take um, food coloring and put it in a bathtub, um, it will quickly dissipate because it'll like spread out, right? But if you put food coloring in like a tiny little cup, it's not really going to dissipate that much because there's not a whole lot of water for it to spread apart. In. Okay. And the last word is decry. This is a really good word. It looks kind of weird, right? It looks like cry and de decry. Decry means to express strong disapproval of something. So I decry lying. It's one of the things that really makes me mad. I decry it. I express strong disapproval of. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to Words of the Day. And if you would like, you can post them in Teams, send me an email, write them on a piece of paper, and bring them to me next year if you're a fourth or a fifth grader, even if you're a sixth grader. Okay, see you guys.